gate dropped. And it was Dan Thornhill in the orange helmet over on the right-hand side who swept through the first turn ahead of everybody else. There was a little bit of traffic in the background as they jammed up in turn two. But it was Thornhill who led. Just behind him, Jimmy Clochet, and then the 43 of Davide de Bortoli and Tom Massux. On the opening lap, though, Clochet went around the outside of Thornhill to take over the lead. Carol Kutsai, championship leader, had a difficult opening lap. And lap two was also just as painful. This time he stayed up. But he was in around about 14th place at that time. De Bortoli then found his way into second, past Thornhill, who then got passed by Massux. Massux then in third. John Adamson got passed by Sefasti, and just after that, Tondell, who'd already uh, gone through before that mistake. Tondell then passed Sefasti. And then Massux stalled whilst challenging second place, De Bortoli. Sefasti was able to find his way past the 195 of Dan Thornhill in the end. That got him up into fifth place. A fall in the latter stages here from Massux. Eventually came home in fourth position because a lap or so later, Cornelius Tondell charged down into third on his JWR Honda. A slight bubble here for David a, uh, Davide de Bortoli. He picked himself up. And that put him under pressure on the final lap. Karol Kutsar eased his way past Martin Micek, a daring move, I should say, on the final lap. That got him up into an eventual ninth place, but it was a win for Jimmy Clochet from Davide de Bortoli and Cornelius Tondell. EMX Open race two here, round four at Trentino. This time, Jimmy Clochet pulled the whole shot. Kim Sebasti got caught, though. Going into the second turn, he had to charge. There was, just at the back there, in the red and white. But it was De Bortoli in second, Carol Kutsar third. That's how it stayed throughout the race. Dan Thornhill crashed out of sixth position. He would eventually remount and finish 12th, as Tom's Masuk, carving his way through the field, found his way past Bolink. And then Micek. Continued to charge through the field, but a broken wheel from John Adamson cost him out of the race. He was in seventh at that stage. Had to DNF the race. Sevasti, he was up to ninth and fell down to 13th. Eventually came home in eighth position as Cornelius toned out down the inside of Domantas Jastuskas. Tondell continued to push on as well. Mike Bolling eventually. Faded to 10th position, but not before Jastuskas tipped over in a turn. Final lap, Karol Kutsar closing right in on the number 43 of Davide de Bortoli for second, but was not able to find a way through. And in the end, it was two wins out of two for your winner, Jimmy Clochet. He was your overall winner as well. De Bortoli, two seconds, second overall, third for Tom's Massups, but your winner is still Karol Kutsar in the championship. Jimmy Clochet, congratulations, a day of first, first European Championship race win, first European Championship podium yeah. and overall. And you made it look easy out there. Yeah, I have great feeling all the day. Uh, so I have a dream and today I realized my dream. So I take the, my first overall in a European Championship and uh, it's really, really incredible. And I would like to thank my father here, my girlfriend, all my family, my friend all the sponsors behind me and uh, it's really really incredible for me and uh, yeah it's difficult for me to explain the cessation today so i'm really happy congratulations Jimmy. thank you, thank you.